He raised him far above all rule and authority, power and dominion and every title that can be given. Not only in this present age, but also in the one to come. Verse 22. And God placed all things under his feet mm -hmm. and appointed him to be head over everything for the church, which is his body. Be careful how you bash church. <laughs> Bible is telling you it's the body of Christ. Be very careful. Jesus is coming. To check all the insults you have been giving to church. You think you are abusing pastor. You don't know he's the body of Christ you are insulting. That's the true. fullness of him who fills everything in every way. Lord, Our promotion due us shall come to us. Amen. Your promotion will not go to your enemy. Amen. All the people right now that are waiting to say, Aha! We told him! They are going to say glory to God and Hosanna and hallelujah at your promotion in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Our God is alive. Yes. He's promoting us. Who would have thought I would be speaking online to people? Thank you, Jesus. What a privilege. There are some people who have relegated you to be a scum of the earth, thinking they are the cream of the society. Forget them. Remember the ascension of Jesus Christ and that he has promoted your life. Believe it! And you will see the manifestations of his good Amen. in your life. Amen. I round up this message with point number four. Talking about the ascension of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ displayed how the rich can take pride in their low positions. Major significance. So important to note. Do likewise. As he displayed how the rich can take pride in their low positions, you do likewise. Let me tell you how that works. You follow Jesus Christ with all of your heart. As you follow him with all of your heart, you must be sincere enough to let him know and have agreement with him. That when he promotes you, you will be willing to come down and help the people that are downtrodden. Because the reason he will promote you up there is because there are people down there. Yeah. Are you willing? Are you listening? Mm -hmm. Jesus displayed it in his lifetime. Can you imagine the president of heaven and the heavens and the owner of everything on earth? Coming so low to die as a criminal to identify with us and not ashamed to call believers brothers? I have seen something terrible amongst men. And that is, a, a, a lot of people, immediately they receive promotion from God, they become arrogant, mm. telling everybody levels have changed. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, character has not changed. Mm. Who cares about your level that is changing? God is concerned about your character changing, my friend. Some people are so arrogant and jealous of your promotion, they want to bring in caution, gossip. They want to say all kinds of lies behind you, backbiting. But Jesus is watching them. The people that will do well in Christ, the people that we walk by the power and ascension of the Lord Jesus Christ, they are the people who are up there, but they know how to come down there and help people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They take pride in their low position. Sometimes when I watch what happens in politics, it makes me laugh. Some, some politicians have forgotten that the reason they are in the assembly, the reason they are in their position is because the masses voted for them. They are forgotten. So they now want to treat the masses as if they are nobodies. God is coming to judge you and your political position and your religious position and whatever position he gave to you. He's coming to judge. Go on stealing the country's money. Go on sleeping with people's wives and people's daughters. Go on defiling our children. He is the judge. He has shown his power in ascension. Will you fear him today and repent of your sins? He's ready with mercy and grace. Hallelujah. And to the people in the body of Christ, so cornerstoneites, the flock of God, under my, uh, under my care, by his grace, 
I encourage you. And to those listening home and abroad, I encourage you. Fear no hardship. Fear no persecution because of rich fools who take advantage of positions that are supposed to humble them. Hmm. Do what will please the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Don't mind the arrogant. Amen. And fear no stigma. A lot of Christians don't testify of where God took them from because they are ashamed of what people will say. That's right. You know what Jesus says? He said, I will be ashamed before the angels and before my Father in heaven. Whoever denies him, he will turn his back on. We are not ashamed. I love the people of Cornerstone and Anointed Hallelujah. Church. You come to the place we worship and hear people from diverse backgrounds who are not ashamed of the gospel. They say things as they are, not afraid of stigma. I watch something on TV. Somebody has been healed. Of course, Jesus Christ arranged the healing through the doctors, arranged the healing through what is happening in the world. The person had to tell another person of this COVID-19 healing after leaving the isolation and the person ran away. So there is now caution. Uh, some people don't want stigma. So they have COVID-19. They will not talk about it. Excuse me, stop letting the devil use you to kill people. That's right. That's right. If presidents and prime ministers of places can have COVID-19 and talk about it, my friend, you that is already down, which name do you want to defend? Mm. He that is down is fear no fall. That's right. We are down in Nigeria. What stigma are we still afraid of? It's time to speak to the glory and power and image of our God in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Don't worry about testimony killers and people looking at you like nobody when you testify. The Lord is praising you. The Lord is saying, that's my child who is taking others from low position to high position exactly as he got there. Hallelujah. Who are you posing for, my friend? Excuse me. Excuse me. Can you cure COVID-19? Are you not humbled? Hmm. Stop being arrogant. Know how to come down from your high horse. You are talking back to your pastor. Who are you? When did you become a judge of your pastor? You are talking back to your father and your mother. When did you get there, you youth? You don't obey any authority? The government now cares so much. They want everybody in isolation. Not for themselves, but for your sake so that you don't die for nothing. But you won't obey. You can't stay at home in isolation. You are even so lazy to wash your hands several times. COVID-19 is coming. They've warned you enough. That's true. It's coming. Why must you get to the position of lawlessness and arrogance? You talk back to your parents. You talk back to the president of Nigeria as if he's your mate. You talk back to the governor of Lagos State as if he is just your personal assistant. Kill your arrogance before you die of your pride. Hallelujah. This is what the ascension is about. It's about the power of our Lord Jesus Christ to do precisely what he had destined his people to do. And finally, I, I remember how I sit down with our gate man and we discuss about families outside there. Sometimes you won't even know I'm the pastor or head pastor of the church. What pride or arrogance do I want to display before any person? When I know where I'm coming from, the humble background I'm coming, I'm coming from. I've noticed that the people that are, this, are coming from humble background are the proudest when God promotes them. Yes. Merely God promotes them. Yes. The first thing they will do is to cancel all the phone numbers of people that they have suffered together. Mm -hmm. Nobody can see them again. Mm -hmm. I may not want you to see me because I don't want my time wasted by you who does not believe. My time is my wealth and my God is my God and my Lord. The time I have on earth is brief and it must be to do the work of God because I don't have time for you to be wasting me and telling me logic that you didn't pass in school. <laughs> there are some people now I just don't have time for them why? because I've spent enough time with them mm. and they're not ready I'm not ready to go into grammar with you mm. Jesus is not a grammarian That's right. and in case you don't know Jesus did not do any English mm. say rabbi <laughs> when he was on earth fear him and I tell you in closing even our driver 
The time, what we needed him for when he would call him driver was to drive our children to school. When the children can all drive, they are all grown up. I called him, what do you want to do now? You can't be driving me. If you look at me even online, you will see that I'm a very powerful man. I don't have been driving since. I got my license from Washington, D.C. I'm glory to God for that. My wife drives. So what do you, do you want to drive now? He was looking. I said, okay, what can you do? He said, this work of driving. And the Lord used my wife and I to go into contribution and give him the money. Now he has his own car that is using for transportation. And I remember that very driver, and I pray God's promotion upon that decision, that you will get into big transportation business in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. As you allow Jesus to give you character. Amen. I have a question for you. You have been praying for God to promote you all this time. Who are you promoting hmm. in your promotion? Hmm. Who are you helping? Hmm. May the Lord breathe into this message. Amen. May the Lord change our good times our bad times to good times. Amen. May the Lord come with testimonies Amen. from this message of ascension of Jesus Christ. Amen. May your family be blessed. Amen. May you be blessed forever. Amen. May critical analysis leave you Amen. except where necessary. Amen. Don't apply it to these messages. It's going to ruin you because it is not applicable. Ascension. Not to the incarnation of Jesus, not to the resurrection of Jesus, and not to the ascension of Jesus. Glory to the Lamb of God who keeps us and makes us more than conquerors in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. I want to thank all of you who listen to this message at home and abroad, everywhere. I appreciate you. The work of God cannot be perfectly uh, perfectly done until there are those bringing it and those taking it may the word you have taken everywhere may it continue to manifest good relationship and blessings in your life mm -hmm. may you be a great worshiper like mary mm -hmm. without fear without shame you, in the name of jesus mm -hmm. may you not go into debate on how to worship your god yes. worship him with your time worship him with your money Worship him with all that you have and throw away the controversies the world are bringing to bring an insult to the name of our God. Don't be participants with those people in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah.